All right, quick lesson. We're gonna do a Western swing lesson. This is a little bit of foreplay to get you all hot and bothered for the intro to Western swing guitar masterclass happening on Saturday at 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. When you're on a long one chord going into a four chord, you want to avoid playing that dominant seven until the measure before or a couple beats before. This isn't like Chicago blues music or like jammy jam music where you hang out on a dominant seven for like 20, 30 minutes while you're waiting for your frozen pizza to cook. What you can do though, is you can target the six, I'm in A, or you could target a major seven. And you could add in half step approaches to those. You could add in chromatic connections. You could add in all different kinds of articulation. But what you want to do is wait for that measure before to introduce the flat seven. Going into your four chord. And what that's going to do is that's going to really pull the listener into the four chord and give more weight to the resolve of the four chord. So after this lesson, you're probably going to want to cool down. I get it. But let's keep it going. Join me on Saturday for the master class. We're going to have PDFs, backing tracks. Uh, there's going to be an hour lesson. There's going to be live Q&A, special deals, aftercare. <laughs> um, link is all down below. Uh, and I'll see you on Saturday.